Okay, so Superstar Rajini is moving at lightning speed. Uh, for normal people, 70 plus is an age where they uh, uh, are daily going to the hospital and uh, resting in the house. But for Superstar, this is the time he rocks the world. Uh, he's always been a person who fought against convention. So uh, he's now uh, fully acting all out just like the younger heroes. Uh, he's doing project after project, non-stop. So running at express speed. Uh, this leads to the question, right? Uh, a question that many fans and even the general public will ask. What would be your next dream team of uh, Rajini? Next film dream, dream team? Who are the kind of people we want him to collaborate with to bring forth the next level entertainment uh, for our joy. So um, let's see now, uh, in terms of directors, a few names are coming to the fore, uh, even very much expected names, for example, Kartik Subaraj, uh, he sort of uh, uh, brought Rajini back from the brink after some crazy experiments by Pa Ranjit and agenda based movie making by Pa Ranjit uh, to bring Rajini back up, uh, Kartik Subaraj took on the task and then uh, he brought Rajini, let's say 50% of the, of, of, of the journey back. And uh, he did an okay job. He got great um, actors like Nawazuddin uh, Siddiqui and um, uh, uh, Vijay Sedupati and so on. However, the writing could have been stronger and each of the characters uh, could have been given more meteor roles and more room to shine. However, I think he was juggling too many things and uh, he also uh, sort of uh, put in his father and so on in, in some role. Uh, so he sort of had to juggle many expectations and so it's not as strong as it could have been. So uh, Karthik Subraj is a shoe in but in terms of whether that will be like the utmost entertainer for us, uh, I still have a bit of doubt on that. The next person who pushed Rajini even further back to the original stratosphere where he belonged is Nelson. So when uh, Karthik Subraj pushed him up by 50%, uh, Nelson brought him up all the way back up. Uh, and so in my video on Rajini vs Kama, you would have seen that when Rajini chose to help to stand by people who are down on their luck, then God smiles on him. So that's how it happened with Nelson. So Nelson, the rumor is heavy, heavy, heavy that Jailer 2 is coming up. You can see also my comment on the comedy video, a comedy movie that Rajini should do on, on something about that. And um, uh, unless the failure of Indian 2 scares them into choosing an, an, another fresh script under Nelson and a good all-out comedy would be something lovely because it's been a long time since Rajini did a full-fledged comedy film, guys. So, Kartik Subraj, Nelson, they would be kind of uh, interesting uh, uh, team up with uh, Superstar Rajini. Certain old names also come to the fore, people like Mani Ratnam, uh, who peaked in the 90s and now his uh, uh, filmmaking is uh, hit or miss. Uh, however, after Pony in Salon, it's possible that uh, Mani Ratnam uh, could be uh, back having momentum. Um, there was a heavy rumor that Rajini wanted to combine with him and suddenly the name Kamal popped up. So I think it's very possible that Rajini decided to either reject the script or something didn't work out and so uh, Kamal took up that role uh, as Thug Life. However, I think it will be still great if Rajini and um, Manitatnam combine again. Just let's cross fingers and hope it does not become like uh, Shankar and Kamal combining again with Indian too. We don't want tragedies like that. Uh, low expectations, um, humble approach, hard work, then uh, I think uh, Mani and uh, Rajini can still do some nice magic. Uh, Mani should maintain his, uh, how to say, out of the box approach. We all love Talabati actually because, not because it was a typical Rajini movie, but because it had a lot of Mani Ratnam's color in it. So, uh, although Rajini himself wasn't so comfortable, um, feeling that the fans are not happy, uh, from my perspective at least, I think many of the fans are very happy with that. That is still a cult classic now. Uh, so we, we have faith in Mani Ratnam unlike uh, Paranjit. So Mani would be another um, great team up. Amongst, uh, if we cast the net wider, then there are other uh, directors like uh, the animal film director in Hindi and we've got uh, SS Rajamouli uh, of Telugu industry and also um, what they call it, uh, Prasant Neel of Kannada film industry. Prasant Neel did KGF and you can just imagine, just imagine even using AI changing um, the hero of KGF into Rajini's uh, profile. The character will just blow up and it will be just so crazy awesome. Somebody should do that, do an AI version of Rajini in, in, in that role. Uh, that is Prasant Neel, but his movies are getting very monotonous. So he also need to look at more creativity. So I won't put him at the top of the list, some of you might. Okay. Um, and then we have, um, uh, who else? Uh, when I talk about Rajamouli just now, Rajamouli, 
um, he is a very very good storyteller he comes from a family or in the movie industry so his potential is good but the achilles heel is that uh, rajamouli he prefers heroes with lots of physicality that means the hero would need to do a lot of action sequences Uh, however i would like to request rajamouli not to rule rajini out because now there's a lot of technology ai stuntman and all these tools uh, that can be used to uh, push the hero forward so uh, maybe rajamouli can think uh, use his creative juices more uh, he even made a movie where the insect the, the fly was was a major character so so that combination would be great i would love to see rajamouli and uh, rajini film together However since he seems to be uh, planning on even grander uh, blockbusters like uh, Mahabharata um, uh, remake and so on so that might although it will be a great combination it might not be feasible so uh, which other exciting filmmakers we have left um let's see now who else is there we've got people like uh, Vetri Maran um, people like Mari Selvaraj Um, so I don't know how well um, these these filmmakers would do with Rajini, but if you want a larger than life canvas, then the director of a recently um, a recent movie called Kalki, which blew up, uh, he can be a contender. Uh, I think he is capable of making movies in a big canvas. Uh, however, since Kalki probably will be a franchise, so he might be occupied with that. Uh, other technicians like um, um, cinematographer, um, there are some cinematographers who, who also uh, I, I don't remember uh, working with uh, a superstar. For example, uh, P. C. Sriram is a great cinematographer. I don't seem to remember P. C. Sriram uh, working with superstar yet. So that would be an interesting team up. Uh, in terms of music director, uh, for example, hip hop Tamila, Yuvan Shankar Raja, there is still a bunch of talent who. uh who would be fun to see in a rajini's team uh moving forward so do you have any other interesting directors moving forward uh even others like alfonso alfonso putran you know they can come from the left field and just give a give a nice movie i think superstar should do one mega big blockbuster type movie with a director and then alternate it with a smaller maybe comedy based or maybe drama based film uh he can easily do about three movies per year and 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 um, for those who say he's old i don't think so uh old is actually in your heart if you feel young then you can do a lot of things right rather than just uh, sitting at home staring at the television or or the phone uh he is an inspiration for all of us to go out there and get things done so those were some of the names i mentioned in terms of music directors in terms of uh, directors uh, right in terms of uh, actors well if you say actors after the loss of raghuvaran who was a very beautiful had a be- very beautiful on screen chemistry with superstar sj surya would make a great combo even vijay sethupathi was not fully explored in uh, petter so he also would, would would i wouldn't mind him uh, reuniting with rajini uh, in another movie So uh Fahad Fazil did the some work in Vetain we have to we have yet to see what what uh, is the outcome of that but SJ Surya was a superstar is definitely going to be an interesting um, combo uh, otherwise in terms of hindi films uh, Salman Khan again there was a big rumor about Salman and Rajini working together but since Murgadas Air Murgadas dropped the ball in Darbar he had promised but somewhere i think after the in the second half he sort of uh, dropped the ball on it uh, over confident reliance on assistant directors these kind of things So uh we do not know if there's any uh, big hindi directors who can bring them together Salman Khan Rajinikanth Adli can be a, can be a contender but Adli said he wanted a movie with a bigger impact than Basha so unless Adli is does his homework rather than uh, just being uh, too much in the enjoyment phase then uh, nothing might come of it so uh, do share guys who do you think should be a dream team for Rajini's uh, uh, next film in 2025 2026 thank you guys share the comments in the comment section take care bye bye much love